Hello there, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another episode here on Passy's Skin. It's an absolute pleasure to have you. Thank you very much for joining us. Tonight, we're actually going to be doing a 25 loot box of winning for the Marvel's loot boxes that are part of Marvel Heroes Omega. We've already done the loot boxes for the Age of Apocalypse. You can check the video out for that somewhere in the comments and links somewhere around this, I'm pretty sure. It'll be easy to find. Don't worry, they're not too far away. Um, the Marvel's loot boxes, let's jump in and take a look at, look, take a looky see at what ones that they have. Uh, we're going to take a batch of 25. So one, I <laughs> never like paying for these. Five, 10, 15, 20, 25. Let's take a look, guys. All right, so Marvelous Loot Box number one of 25 for the post 1.4 patch uh, with Age of Apocalypse. Let's see what we got. Four Marvelous Essence, high-tech fabric, a loaded credit chest, no, not too bad. 25 Marvelous Essence, 20 Relics of Asgard, and two Shield Supply Boosts. That's actually a reasonably kind of good utilitarian box, uh, with a large amount of Marvelous Essence, so that's not too bad. Uh, we'll move on to the next one. <laughs> I know I've got time limited here because the server's going to go down very shortly, so let's see what happens. Oh, thank you very much for the subscription there, guy. Uh, four Marvelous Essence, Weapon X Spray Paint, 10 Relics of Subterranea, Black Widow Cheer. Uh, overflowing credit chest, yay! And uh, Black Widow show off. So we got two actual cheer, two emotes. Um, I was complaining about the emotes in the previous uh, video whenever I was doing the Age of Apocalypse ones. I'm not a big fan if these are going to be replacing costume drops, but if they're actually in a different tier of uh, receiving, then I'm actually happy to see myself kind of filling out my gaps with these. In fact, to get two of them for Black Widow, it's enough to actually you've got you need three to actually fill out your list for your custom emotes. So yeah, and, uh, nice to see that. Uh, Black Widow Cheer and Black Widow Show Off. Just, I don't know which ones. <laughs> Do they both go into the same slot? That's what I'm curious about. But yeah, otherwise, uh, not a great box because, well, good credits, but no no costumes. That's So that's two for two. No costumes yet. Four Marvel Assassins, a Daredevil Spray Paint, a Currency Boost, a Combination Boost, ten Unstable Molecules, and a Thor Show Off. Now, this is starting to get worrisome because um, there's so many emotes that you could possibly get in this that I'm actually worried that the... Um, uh, the, I'm worried about the amount of emotes you're going to be getting instead of your costumes, and that's not good, man. That's not good at all. Continuing on here. Two Eternity Splendors, four Marvelous Assassins, ten Relic of Wakanda, ten Legendary Marks, ten Eternity Splendors, and two Shield Supply Boosts. Uh, um, uh, we're three down. Well, no, we're four down, and I, I like getting Relics. They're always making me more stacks. Boosts are always... Like, they're the kind of things that I expect to be in all these crates anyway. So, um... Mm, but I'm leery. I'm kind of feeling leery about this. Not liking so far. So we've got four down and not a single costume. Four Marvel's Essence. A Dimensional Prism Flourish. Currency Boost. Ten Legendary Marks. An Iceman Cheer. And a Duplicate Costume Bonus Essence of 30. So yep, we got a costume. First one. It's about one in five. So it's one of the costumes I already have out of the Marvel's loot boxes that are available. They've chained the rotation up, but there's still a lot of costumes that I picked up and actually received from buying the costumes with the characters whenever I got them or whenever they were still uh, gettable with uh, energy splinters or uh, the splinters during the early stages of the game. So yeah, I was a bit curious about that. I'm kind of like looking at this going, like, mm, not cool, not cool with this. Uh, but it's another costume I already have. So more Marvel's Essence. I can buy a replacement one with it. Good box of 30. Um, I had a weird thing with the boxes early on. I got an, an epic box whenever I got my Omegas for the characters. And it wound up giving me a box that said it had 580 splinters inside it. But it was actually an 80 splinters box. It's just made somebody didn't delete the 5 from the differences between the 50 and 80 box. 4 Marvel Assassins, Mechanical Components, 10 Relics of the Gibrahim, 10 Cosmic Fragments, 10 Relics of Xandar, and the Hulk Planet Hulk costume. Nice, that's actually the one, that's one of the ones I wanted to get. I wanted to actually have the planet... It's actually the nicest looking Hulk costume, because actually I don't like the face on some of the Hulk costumes. The uh, movie ones don't look... They look uh, they're, they're, not very, they're not very Ruffalo, to be honest. But it's just like that. I don't like the head shape and stuff in them. And then the other Marvel Now one, I don't like the shield and the armor that he's wearing. This, uh, I like this Hulk. I actually like the design in it. I actually like the texturing and the skin. I'm cool and happy with that costume. So yeah, we've got two, uh, well, two and six. All right, so this is actually getting better. We've got one, one third, 30% kind of going on this. Two Eternity Splinters, four Marvelous Essence, Enhanced Genomes, Shield Supply Boost, 10 Unstable Molecules, and an overflowing credit chest. Yep. Okay, I'm, I'm buying a lot of schematics yeah, and stuff to actually kind of level up my engineering and my different crafters and stuff. So massive stacks of JS. That's that's another two of those. There's about forty thousand, then the ten thousand, and another twenty thousand in materials. 
So that means I can get that leveled up as fast as possible. Always happy to get the big overflowing ones. Credits aren't hard to come by, but it's kind of nice to actually get a boost like that because I'm sitting with plenty of cash to be able to work my way down. Alright. War Marvelous Essence, a shitty credit chest. <laughs> Immediately after saying that, a currency boost. A matrix of unbinding. You always gotta have one, man. You gotta have one. Gotta at least have one matrix of motherfucking unbinding here <laughs> somewhere. 10 unstable molecules and 50 legendary marks. Um, after getting some crates that had 300 legendary marks in them, I'm a little bit leery about having... I, like, I, don't, I'm, I just don't, don't care. <laughs> like, legendary, whenever you see ones that actually have 300 in them, I'm like, I can just buy one with that. And I'm getting good legendary mark drops because of my currency boost. They're, they don't seem to actually, they don't feel as, uh, as useful as Marvelous Essence or even Eternity Splinters. Um, let's go on to the next one. Two Eternity Splinters, four Marvelous Essence, a experience boost, ten unstable molecules, two more experience boosts, and a relic of Subterranea. Alright, so 50 relics of Subterranea. Pretty sure that's another relic total. I've got enough for another hundred. Uh, experience boost by two. That's by three, actually, sorry. Uh, well, I've got so many now, which is awesome because I'm going to... It means I can power level so many of the characters. I need to get I need to get everybody up to 60. So anybody I haven't done to 60 yet, I'm going to actually do a... Uh, what was that? <laughs> that was a different noise than I'm normally used to hearing. Was that actually from a phone or something? <laughs> if that was a donation, I'd be a little bit concerned. Thank you very much. I didn't realize it actually had a different uh, ringtone than anything else. Um, yeah, uh, experience boots. I've got so many of them now that it's actually a... Uh, it's it, it feels like... The, I could probably burn through all the characters. Anybody I don't already have at 60, I could show you guys a run to 60 run. Probably a, one, one, one every day until the end of the month. So I might do that for something like November or December with the, with the game whenever. I, if there's no big events going on at the same time. So um, let's move on to the next box. I've only, got, I've only got 10 more minutes left, I'm pretty sure, before this whole server shuts down. Four Marvelous Essence, a shitty credit chest. God damn it. Hit that one. You can shove, you can shove that credit chest up your ass. Uh, 10 Relics of Asgard. A Doctor Strange cheer. I don't even use Doctor Strange, but it'll be nice to get to run him at some point. 20 relics of Subterranea. So that's 30 relics in one box. And an overflowing credit chest. Right, so we're 10 cal we're ten in and we've had two costume drops. That's not good. The Marvel Sleep Boxes are not... <laughs> that's not a great combination. I'm not going not go with that at all. So 2 and 10. Compared to the 12 and 25 of the Age of Apocalypse boxes, that's... that's mm, not, I'm not even seeing large amounts of uh, Marvel's Essence either. I'm literally just getting the bare minimal four. Not great boxes, guys. Four Marvel's Essence, a small character experience token for Lucas Cage. Ionic particles, ten cosmic fragments, twenty-five eternity splinters, and another overflowing credit chest. <laughs> We've got plenty of money. I'm getting so much money. This reminds me a while lot of the Spider-Man Homecoming uh, chests that actually had a lot of those backpacks in it. They were like I got so much money from that. But I wasn't cool with the um, dra with the, with the drop rates. I was like, I was happy with the money because I've sold all those items now to actually give me enough cash to buy all the materials I need. But still, that's that's eleven crates and only two costumes. Four Marvel's Essence, a small character experience token for magic, a loaded credit chest, ten thousand shield supply boost, a Wolverine show off, and a duplicate cosmic ca cosmic chest. All right, so we've got three a cosmic costume. That's kind of cool. Uh, it's the it's the that's a 50 tier, so it's actually a cosmic one. Obviously, yellow. Um, no idea who it's going to be, but it's probably one of the ones I've actually had for a long time. Uh, another emote, which is nice to have. So that's 3 and 13. Or no, 3 and 12. 3 and 12. <laughs> I've got a countdown now that I have to beat this time. I have to, I have to get this done beforehand. So we've got four Marvelous Essence. We've got a lightweight armor plate. Unstable molecules. Two experience boosts. And, oh, wow. Okay, so another two costumes in one drop, which is awesome. I really love that, and it's a Cosmic and an Ordinary, so that would actually be, it's a, not trash one, but it, Cosmic and Ordinary is actually not too bad. So that was actually, that's four costumes in 13. No, <laughs> one, two, I have four drops, but five costumes. <laughs> like that's, let me keep track of it. So five costumes in 13. Uh, all of them, of course, duplicates so far, which is kind of annoying. I kind of, I want to, uh, oh no, uh, Planet Hulk. Man, my brain is so fried today. I must be making mistakes left, right, and center if I'm actually like repeating myself and then saying the wrong thing. Literally minutes afterwards. Uh, five, five and thirteen. Yes, my brain. Uh, water, water will wake my ass up. <laughs> okay, it'll help me focus. I need this water. Ah, oh, life-giving water. Mm. Four Marvel's essence. A Captain America spray paint. Unstable molecules. <laughs> a shield supply boost. Fifty legendary marks and a duplicate cosmic or uh, duplicate rare bonus chest uh, for costumes. So that's actually six. 
six and six and fourteen. So uh, we're getting, the odds are going back up again. Like it's just, it seems to be just a very bad start that I had there with a lot of money in them. I think it's actually like that double chest is kind of going to make up for a lot of it. But six and fourteen. Four Marvel's Essence, a minor experience boost, a Cosmic Fragment, a random hero ultimate gift, we'll find out what that is maybe afterwards if we have time, a combination boost, and a ultimate power upgrade for absolutely anyone. Which is great. I actually prefer those. Um, not a great chest, but um, good utility stuff. But, uh, yeah. At least it wasn't vendor trash kind of um, materials. Five legendary marks, four Marvel's Essence, a shitty credit chest. 10 unstable molecules, a random hero ultimate gift, and 50 legendary marks. Eh, I'm looking here. That's not a great one. Especially when, anytime I see, anytime you see that horrible chest, you kind of go like, ah, you kind of ruined one of the slots in this thing, man. That's really not cool. Right, well, moving on. Hmm. On to the next one, got eight left to do. Four Marvelous Essence, Mechanical Components, Ionic Particle, a Hawkeye Cheer. I actually want to see that one. Two Experience Boosts and 50 Legendary Marks. Mm. We're back to the we're back to the same tone that I actually had with the first few boxes. Like, this is pretty much... We already got this box, I think, already. Except for Hawkeye, I think it was Blackwood. No, Blackwood had two in it. Uh, but yeah. Uh, uh. Four Marvelous Essence, Energized Particles, Nanotech Filament, 25 Marvelous Essence. Overflowing credit chest. Overflowing credit chest. <laughs> so that's how we are coming down money. We got plenty of the monies. And that actually wasn't too bad. 25 Marvel Essence. 29 Marvel Essence in a single box. It's as good as you actually got. If I got another duplicate costume, like a normal vendor one. So that's actually all right. I'm, 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 not, I'm not offended by that because you can. Like two of those, you bought it. You got yourself a costume. Four Marvel Essence. Energized particles. Currency boost. Two experience boost. A Thor show off. Ooh, and a new Iron Fist? Ooh, nice! Awesome, I did not know there was a new Iron Fist costume. I actually like that one. That is a, I like the Mortal Iron Fist costume. I like that one. It's like, it's just the fact that the Danny Rand with just the tat, really terrible tattoo in his face and maskless, I'm not a fan of, but I actually don't mind the topless with the <laughs> with the Kung Fu pants and the sash that, and the mask. That actually, I, like that. I actually like that design. Go on, a Mortal Iron Fist. <laughs> I didn't even know there was actually a new one for him. You would have thought they might have actually thrown that one in with the Defenders, but no. That's the reason why I enjoy whenever they do these updates, they do drop new costumes, and I still haven't seen some of them. Um, I should really do I should go through and like look at all the costumes, but I mean, I'm getting a surprise like this is well worth it. So that's two costumes that we actually got. We've got uh, Planet Hulk and a more Iron Fist, but they're, and that's seven. Seven in... Seven in 19... Uh, the, the, the ratios are still keeping okay. 7 and 19. Four Marvelous Essence, a small character experience token for Jean Grey, a currency boost, shield supply boost, 20 relics of Asgard, and 50 legendary marks. Nice. That's actually not too bad. Uh, huh. No, they, they don't else really to say other than that. But, um, relics of Asgard, always like having them. They're actually, like, it's the most common uh, relic that I put on characters, so if I have one, I use it. I have to keep swapping it back and forth between people sometimes. So that's where I've been using my matrixes of unbinding. Woo! All right. Uh, also, in fact, whenever I don't have a full stack, I'll put 99 on somebody just for that point. So 10 Marvelous Essence, 4 Marvelous Essence, full 14 to start with, and a shitty credit chest. I like I said before, it puts the mood down. Five minutes left. Oh, shit, we got a pair of hurry. Okay, combination boost, uh, 50 legendary marks. Punisher Omega Effect costume! I've wanted this one since the game came out, and you weren't able to purchase it even, like, I think early on. I'm fucking happy with that. I'm looking forward to playing through the Punisher now that I have that costume. He's going to be one of the next characters I'll take one to sexy. I'm looking forward to playing with him. Happy days. I actually like that design. I really do. Despite the armor, despite the armor, Punisher was hurt while fighting Vulture during his 2012 particular comic series. Despite the damage eye, he manages to be tough as ever, going on to battle alongside Spider-Man and Daredevil in the pursuit of the Omega Drive. Nice. We got four costumes left. We got four four boxes left. We got four minutes left. So we got to do these really quickly. Four Marvel Assassins, a credit chest. 10 relics of the Keeper him. A matrix of fun binding. A matrix of fun binding. <laughs> God damn it. Why do you have to do it in the last couple of crates where I have to actually slow myself down to do the pace? A duplicate credit chest or duplicate uh, chest for a costume for 30. So that brings us up to uh, 8, 9, 9 costumes in the stack so far. But 3, uh, <laughs> 4 Marvel Assassins, a Spider Man spray paint, a loaded credit chest, 10 legendary marks, a shield supply boost, and 50 legendary marks. That was a garbage chest. We're moving on. <laughs> 
Burn down the last two. Two Eternity Splinters, four Marvel Assassins, a loaded credit chest, so relic, 20 relics of Subterranea, 25 Eternity Splinters, and Nightcrawler show off. Happy days. Do love Nightcrawler. I want to see what he's got to say. I hope it's actually something to do with his swords, like holding them in his steel or something. Uh, moving on to the last one, we've got one crate left. We can get the crates done and dusted and out of the way, at least I can talk about them afterwards after the server's gone. Five <laughs> legendary marks, four marvelous essence, a small credit character experience token, a matrix of unbinding. <laughs> 10 cosmic fragments and an ultimate power upgrade. The last couple of last couple of those crates were just trolling the shit out of me. <laughs> Matrixes were fucking unbinding all of them in the last couple of crates. <laughs> oh, 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 you sons of bitches. <laughs> not cool with that. Mm, not right. It's just not right. What can we do? Well, what can we do whenever we look at something like that? Uh, it was nine costumes all out. All, nine costumes all together out of the stack of 25. Not an offensive amount of costumes. Um, I'm actually happy enough with that. But the problem was that all the costume ones I already had. So I'm a little bit disappointed in that. But we'll try and do something about that in the future. Um, yeah. That was, that was not smart. That was not fun. <sighs> I'm a little bit disappointed. But, uh, well, nine and, nine and 25. The ratio keeps out reasonably well. We're still sitting at about the 40, the the 42, 45% mark. <laughs> and man's hanging out next day, next day here. We're literally waiting for the servers to shut down there, and I don't really know what else to really say. Guys, thank you very much for actually watching. This has been another 25 loot crates, uh, 12, 25 loot crates for uh, Marvel Heroes Omega done. Um, they, uh, if you like to see, if you, if you think the loot drop rates were reasonable enough, make sure to comment below. Uh, make sure to have your thoughts and feelings put across. Uh, I think if I'm sure like the, my videos aren't big enough for the point where like gazillion might be watching but they do probably trawl through a lot of these community stuff especially with the fact that they give me G's to do those crates so they're probably wanting to see what kind of reaction they actually get so you know you can actually probably get somebody to be able to read your comments underneath if you actually want things to be heard directly um, again thank you very much for watching it's been an absolute pleasure um, sorry I actually just realized that there's no chat down in the corner there I could be able to read your chat as you guys talk but, um, it actually, yeah, I just must have turned it off at some point between, uh, well, this video and the previous one. But, uh, we'll have that back whenever we're doing it again. And thank you very much to the subscriber during the actual, uh, recording of this. And thank you very much to anybody else who's been here and enjoying the videos. So, uh, thank you very much for watching. And if you happen to be watching this on YouTube, there'll be a button up there. I'd really appreciate you'd hit. Uh, there is a playlist here that's going to have most of the stuff from Marvel Heroes Omega all together on it. On the far side will be the most recent video on the channel. And right here will be a video just for you based on the user analytics and the things you do on YouTube. It will pick the video and you will enjoy it and it'll be right there. So I highly recommend you click the one that she appears in that corner. Thank you very much for watching. Now I'll see all you dudes in the next video. Bye.